Yo, what's up guys? It's your boy Nigel Storm here. Welcome back to Revive the Witch. So apologies for the late upload. I'm still a little bit ill, but this one's going to be a relatively quick one because um, it's a new month and um, I haven't made the video on it yet until now, but um, the Golden Petal Shop has been reset because of the new month of um, June and this time is actually a pretty big one because it's Tonel. And as for you know, Tonel is basically still, I, I would, could, you could argue, the most used character in the entire game. Um, you can basically use her everywhere and then she'll support your team very very well. Um, I do have her, so fortunately I can take a look at her skills. So this is Tonel. Um, I do have her at 442. Um, her, I guess her optimal skill level would be 452, um, which I'll show you here at level 5. As you can see, um, she'll increase the doll's attack by 40% of her own attack and increases the damage dealt by 15%. At level 4, that becomes 36% of her attack and heals all allies for only 50 percent of 45% but in any case um, let's take a look at her skills so at 442 um, her first skill is a two order skill um, it's basically a heal a heal everyone with a shield that absorbs damage for the same amount that she healed so you could essentially say that this is a 268% effectiveness in terms of healing but half of that is a shield the second skill is the charge skill which is very strong um, if your other dolls activate four skills this charge will activate and will automatically activate this skill which heals all allies for 45% of our own attack per second for 10 seconds and gives them a buff that boosts their attack by 36% of her own attack and the damage dealt by 15% now to be honest if you think about it like this just from the first two skills alone she is very good but you could argue that she wouldn't be used um, everywhere if she was only known for that. That's where her passive comes in, which is insane. So at level 2, her passive is called Child of Taboo. And at level 2 passive, it generates one chaos energy every 2 seconds. So every 2 seconds, you'll just generate one purple for free. And this alone is the reason why Tonel is used everywhere. This passive. Because the majority of your dps in the game right now they love to use chaos skills and that uses chaos energy and so with this passive you'll be able to spam your chaos skills much more frequently especially considering you're still using your order skills which generate chaos energy depending on the number of order energy you used so on top of that you get two i mean one chaos energy every two seconds on top of that and so you'll be able to spam your damaging skills more often, leading to a total increase in DPS. Now, um, unfortunately, she doesn't have a unique equipment yet. It's currently unavailable, but there's not a thing really to worry about. Like, just from that kit alone, her passive is so insane that that is the reason why I would tell you to get her right now if you can. Obviously, since it's a dupe for me, there's no need for me to get her. But for those that don't have her and have the spare um, petals, do get her if you don't have her. Because she makes things very, very easy for most content and she works on basically every single team if you're missing, you know, certain characters for other elements. Uh, but yeah, that's all I've got time for. Um, all I got time for this video obviously to build toenail you just want to build as much attack as you can so you can utilize her buff from her charge skill to the fullest but yeah if you guys got any more questions regarding toenail and the golden petal shop do let me know down in the comments below but I would highly suggest getting her guys oh also one more thing before I end the video uh, don't forget to use your white petals to buy all the gold petals from the white petal shop so you can save them up for gold petal purchases in any case it's been your boy nigel storm 
I'll see you guys in the next stream or video. Peace.